Hello, in this video I will teach you how to add two static arrays. Um, so the first thing we're going to need is a constant int. We can call it array1. Let's make it of size 5 and let's make the other array of size 4. The reason you need constant is because um, the compiler will know at compile time that this value is fixed. If you don't put const and just int, uh, the program is not going to run the way I, I'm going to teach you. Alright, so let's make the first array. Let's call it first array. And it's going to be of size array 1. So let's put the values 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And the second array is going to be of size array 2. And let's put the values 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, so now we just need the two for loops, nested for loops. So int i equals 0 as long as i is less than. And this is why you need const, because you want to do it less than array 1 i plus plus and inside this for loop you have the second for loop and as long as this one is less than array 2 c plus plus okay so here's where we're gonna give out the answer so um, so array Sorry, should I call it the first array? I plus call it second array equals. So it's going to equal first array. I times uh, plus sorry plus second array C and we're gonna end the line all right so this is gonna take the first array at position I which is gonna be the first one plus the second array at position C and it's gonna keep adding that those values and that's pretty much it so let's finish the program return zero and let's see how it runs sorry oh, do, 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 do. oh. Okay. All right, so as you can see, two plus one is three, two plus one, two plus two, two plus three, two plus four, and then it moves on to three plus one, three plus two, three plus three, all the way till it gets to six plus four. And that's about it. Thank you for watching.